and welcome back to my channel. This is Mother Pear. In today's video, I wanted to share with you what's in my toddler bag. Luna is now 15 months old and we still take a bag every time we leave the house because you never know, you might have to change a nappy or she might get hungry or you know whatever so we still take a bag with us and it's full of all the necessary things and I just wanted to share with you what's in our toddler bag first things first this is our bag it is from Baba Bing and I've been loving it since Luna was born we have received this as a gift from a friend and you know now she's 15 months old and it's still going strong so yeah it's it's a lovely lovely bag it looks really stylish I love I just love the way it looks. I always receive compliments whenever I have it with me, so it's a good point, I guess. It has adjustable straps and has many, many pockets inside as well as outside, so you can really fill it up. This bag came with changing travel mat and I actually have it inside so I, show, I will show in a second. And it also came with the bottle warmer which I did use sometimes and I found that very useful. It also came with two straps that you can attach to your pram, so very useful indeed. Now I love this bag so, so much and like I said, it looks gorgeous, but I did find some negative things to it over the time. Um, first of all, it is very heavy. It's super heavy on its own and when it's completely full, it's, oh my God, it's very heavy. So this is something that you should consider before buying, just, um, just yeah, just see, see whether you like the weight. Um, because the material is quite thick, you know, it's quite strong, so I think that's why it's, it's pretty heavy. Another thing which is actually really important, you cannot really do the zip with one hand, especially when it's hanging on your pram. It's just impossible. Um, this is something obviously is not very good for mums, but um, you know, over time I've just mastered to close it. But this is also something to bear in mind because at the beginning, you know, you, you're juggling the baby, the bag and so many other things and you can't close the bag. So, I mean, it's quite a downside to it. But nonetheless, you know, I just, like I said, I really love the bag. It looks so gorgeous. So I just kept it and I've been loving it since. Right, so let's open the bag. First things first is a changing mat. Now this one came with the bag and it's really lovely and very useful. Um, but over time I realized it's actually taking so much space in the bag that not always I take this one with me. I much prefer now the disposable mats, which actually I use them quite a few times before I throw them away. And obviously they're just these little mats and it's really good because they, they, they have no weight to them and they take so little space, obviously compared to this one. And yeah, I love these ones so much. So I always have these in my bag. Another item and obviously very important are nappies. I always have them in my bag and I always carry about three nappies with me. And of course wipes and at the moment I am using Tesco Biodegradable Extra Sensitive Wipe which I actually really like. At the beginning I was not too convinced because they're quite, can be quite flimsy and very thin, but I've got used to them and it's just really nice that they're biodegradable. Um, so I just use them ever since. And I believe they're about 60 pens, which I think this, this is very affordable. And of course I always carry a couple of nappy bags. Um, this is for any, you know, dirty nappies or any dirty clothes. So these are very useful. And actually these are biodegradable as well. They are the beaming baby ones. Another item that I have in my bag are of course snacks for Luna. I've got a ton of them. I always carry a lot of snacks with me. Um, she's definitely a snacker and she loves the snacks. And you know, I sometimes even have arguments with her over dinner or lunch because she just refuses to, to have it sometimes. But I always carry snacks with me. So this time in my bag, I've got organics, cheese and herb puffs, 
which she really likes these ones these are super yummy and there are a lot of them in here and yeah she just really loves these ones but I try to alternate all these puffs because she's actually one of these children who gets bored of them after some time and another thing I have today is Skidilicious wafers um, these are very very yummy I actually tasted them and they're really like lovely snack it's very light I think there is just just no calories or something because it tastes like like it literally tastes like fruity air it's madness but she really likes these ones so I carry these ones with me as well another snack I've got in here raisins and I've got these in little pouches which she really loves she just loves opening it and taking one by one or sometimes obviously spilling all of them but she really likes raisins at the moment and I think it's just a lovely snack to have and usually I have a fruit pouch with me or a yogurt pouch with me and some of them I make myself but today I don't have that one and I actually have a pasta bolognese today and this is just in case she gets very hungry um, yeah and I just give one of these ones to her if she wants it um, sometimes, sometimes I make the food myself and I would take that with me um, but at the moment I think all of them are in the freezer so I've just got this one and another item I always have in my bag is bib and this one is just a very simple light bib and it's a cloth one actually but they just because they're so easy and light and you know you can just wipe their dribble wipe the dirt whatever so I always have one in here and yeah this one is actually quite dirty so I'm going to put that in a wash <laughs> Another really important item are, oh god, it's all the way around, all the way around. I always carry some change of clothes because I think I mentioned before Luna is actually a messy baby. I'm sure all the babies are really messy. Um, we now and then have some leakage or she gets food all over herself, whatever. So I always have extra extra clothes for her to change into and at the moment it's summertime so I only got a short sleeve body and just leggings so that would do. Also another item that I've started carrying with me everywhere I go recently are soft shoes. She has started walking and she's really into it at the moment so um, sometimes she actually doesn't want to be in her pram anymore so I just put these on and she's good to go and uh, she just loves these and these these ones I got from Etsy and I really recommend these lovely lovely soft leather shoes because they are just the perfect size as well as obviously they're really soft and really comfy to wear and yeah I think these are the only ones that also Luna doesn't try to take them off so I bet these must be very comfy on her on her feet so yeah I highly recommend these ones depending on the weather I would always have a hat for Luna as well as uh, some sunscreen for Luna as well as myself but if it's uh, autumn or just a rainy day I would grab some overalls because like I said she's really into walking at the moment but at the same time she's also into crawling and falling so if I don't want her to get very messy I just put these overalls on and it's she's good to go and I really love actually these ones we've been using these in the garden after a rainy day and they've been just fantastic obviously as well if we're going to a swimming class which we are not at the moment due to lockdown sadly um but yeah we would obviously take all of her swimming gear all of my swimming gear so the bag would be even heavier other than that i always have some snacks for myself this time i've got some nuts in there and i've got a little uh, compartment in here um with all of my stuff so there is a wallet in there I've got some lip balm and uh, eye drops which I always need and also I've got a lipstick as well as uh, some chewing gum of course and little candy for some sugar. 
So yeah, there are quite a few compartments here inside and uh, I just basically fill it up as much as I can. So I don't know if you can see it, but basically it's quite big inside. And of course, I always have on the side pocket, I always carry some water for Luna and water for myself, which actually I forgot to put that in today. And at the front pocket, at the moment, I have a variety of sanitizers, one for Luna and of course one for me. And I also have a mask in case I need to pop into a store or anything. And I've got some tissues here as well. Here it is, here are all the items I have in my toddler bag. Um, I usually just alternate a couple of things at a time depending on the weather uh, but most of the time these are the items I have in my bag. I really hope you enjoyed today's video and I would love to know what's in your toddler bag so do let me know in the comments down below. If this is the kind of content you enjoy please consider subscribing and I will see you next time. Bye!